welcome to our channel easy learn funny learn please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to receive notifications hi my dear kids in this video we are going to see chapter 8 ms word 2010 from national cyber olympiad nco mtg workbook of class 4 first question which of the following features has been used in the given text a text effect b text highlight color option c strike through d both a and b so please pause the video and please see the given text so only text effect and text highlight color option has been applied to the given text okay only text effect and text highlight color option so option d both a and b option d is the correct answer both a and b second one clear format tool is used to dash a clear all the formatting from the selection leaving only the plain text b clear all the formatting from the selection leaving only the bold text c clear all the formatting from the selection leaving only the italic text d delete all the selected text so the given icon is clear formatting so it will clear all the formatting from the selection leaving only the plain text option a is the correct answer option a third one what would be the result after following the given step step 1 type a word hello step 2 select the word and apply bold italic and underline on it step 3 select the word and click on clear formatting so option a normal text hello b bold italic hello c normal text italic with underline option d normal hello with underline so when you apply the clear formatting option on the text that is as instructed in step 3 it clears all the previous applied formatting okay that is bold italic and underline from the text hence leaving only the plain text so option a is the correct answer option a fourth one observe the given text referred as text 1 and text 2 how would the text in text 2 would you appear if you select the text in text 1 then click on format painter and then select and drag the mouse over the text referred as text 2 so please pause the video and check the text okay text 1 a lazy day with strike through text 2 an awesome day so please pause the video and check the option a b c and d so when you apply the format painter option it is used to, to copy the formatting from one place to another okay format painter will used to copy the formats okay only the formats from one place to another so in text 1 bold and strike through format is used so it will apply the same format bold and strike through will be applied to the text 2 so option a is the correct answer option a fifth one match the icons given in column 1 with their names in column 2 so please pause the video and check the icons given in column 1 so we already discussed that column a and b so a is text highlight color a icon is text highlight color a4 a4 so b is format painter b is format painter so b1 b1 c is change case okay c is change case so c2 and then d is clear formatting d is clear formatting so a4 b1 c2 d3 option a is the correct answer option a 61 the home tab of the ribbon is used to dash a printed document b change font size style and color in a document 
C. Insert pictures and shapes to the document. D. View the header and footer in the document. So we know the home tab of the ribbon is used to change the font size, color and styles in a document. Option B is the correct answer. Option B. Seventh one. How can you select the entire paragraph in a document? A. Double click inside the paragraph. B. Single click inside the paragraph. C. Single click and press enter. D. Triple click inside the paragraph. So, to select the entire paragraph in a document, you need to triple click inside the paragraph. Okay? You need to triple click inside the paragraph. So, option D is the correct answer. Option D. Eighth one. Given below is the snapshot of navigation pan. That appears when you select this option. Now suppose you have typed IS in the search box of navigation pan. Then how many total number of words would be highlighted in the text enclosed in a box shown here. So computer is an electronic device that is designed to work with information A0, B1, C2, D4. So when you type IS in the search box of navigation pan as shown in the given figure, okay, it will highlight the word is in the given text, okay. That So there are total two occurrence of this word. So is, computer is, then that is. So two yes, occurrence of is word is two. So the correct answer is option C, 2. Okay, option C, 2. Ninth, the function of the given icon is to dash. A. Create small letters below text baseline. B. Draw a line through the middle of the selected text. C. Decrease font size. D. Center the text. So the given icon is strike throw effect okay it is known as strike throw effect it will draw a line through the middle of the selected text okay option b is the correct answer option b 10th select the incorrect match okay we need to select the incorrect match option a so please pause the video and please check the given options a Apply visual effect to the selected text. It is the correct match. B. Change the text color. It is also correct match. C. Bold italic underline. So make selected text bold italics and underline. So correct match. D. Calibri. So make text look like it was marked with a highlighter pen. So option D is incorrect match because it is used to change the font face so option d is the incorrect match the correct answer is option d okay option d 11th what is the shortcut key to open thesaurus option a shift plus f7 b f7 c alt plus f7 d control plus f7 so the correct option is Shift plus F7. Shift plus F7. So option A is the correct answer. Option A. Twelfth. In order to reach at the end of the document, dash key combination is pressed. Option A. Control plus home. B. Control plus end. C. Alt plus home. D. Alt plus end. So, control plus ND key combination is pressed, okay. Control plus ND key of combination is pressed in order to reach at the end of the document. So, option B is the correct answer. Option B. Thirteenth, which change case option should be used to format the text given in column 1? To text given in column 2. So column 1 all are given in small letters. So in column 2 
all sentences begins with a capital letter okay so now let's see the option option a sentence case b lower case c upper case d title case so to format the text given in column one to text given in column two we use sentence case option okay sentence case option option a is the correct answer option a sentence case 14th to select text without using the mouse press the dash a windows key b f5 key c arrow keys while holding down control key d arrow keys while holding down shift key so to select text without using the mouse press arrow keys holding down the shift key okay arrow keys while holding down the shift key so option d is the correct answer option d 15th the thesaurus provides a list of dash for a given word a antonyms b synonyms c verbs d both a and b d both a and b so thesaurus will give both synonyms and antonyms so option d both a and b is the correct answer both a and b it is like a dictionary okay next one is achiever section 16th one which of the following statement hold true regarding word wrap okay statement one word wrap is when a word is deleted because it is too long to fit in a line it is the wrong statement okay it is the false statement two a word wrap is when ms word determines if there is a room for a word at the end of a line or if it must go on the next line so statement two is true okay a only statement one b only statement two c both statement one and two d neither statement one nor statement two so statement one is false only statement two is true so option b is the correct answer option b 17th to go to the beginning or the end of a long document instantly dash respectively a press control plus page up and control plus page down b press shift plus home and shift plus end c press control plus home and control plus end d click on the thumb button on the scroll bar so the correct option is option c to go to the beginning or the end of a long document instantly press control plus home and control plus end option c is the correct answer option c 18th which of the following statement is correct regarding the given icon 1 and 2 so icon 1 is subscript and icon 2 is superscript okay now let's see the options option a creates a small letter below the text baseline for example fourth two creates a small letter above the line of a text for example four uh, above th okay so option a is correct option a is correct b one shortcut key to it is control plus plus equal to key to shortcut key to is control plus shift plus plus equal to key so option b also correct option b also correct c one draw a line through the middle of the selected text incorrect strike through will do this one to increase font size so option c is incorrect only option a and b are correct okay option d both a and b option d both a and b 19th complete the given steps by replacing question if you have misspelled a word computer as computer steps select the word 
counter that is C O M P U T R. You forgot to put a letter E. Okay. Review tab, proofing group, then question mark. Spelling and grammar dialog box appear. Select word computer from the suggestion list. Click on change button. So again, please pause the video and see the option A, B, C, and D. Okay, D is none of these. So to correct the misspelled word computer, select the word computer from the given suggestion list and click on change button. Okay. So the question mark will be filled by option A. Okay. Option A. Last one. Pressing Ctrl plus backspace is used to dash. Option A. Delete the previous character from the cursor. B. Delete the text from the current position to the beginning of the current line. C. Delete the word towards the left of the cursor. D. Delete the entire sentence containing the cursor. So, pressing Ctrl plus backspace is used to delete the word towards the left of the cursor okay delete the word towards the left of the cursor so option c is the correct answer option c thank you my dear kids for watching this video if you like this video please like and subscribe if you have any doubt please mail me at easylearnfunnylearn at gmail.com thank you